Salam and welcome to Kyrgyzstan, a country which is defined by its mountains. This is why in this episode we are focusing on outdoor adventures, we check out the local life and we're gonna taste the local cuisine. start this outdoor adventure here in Kyrgyzstan in a real Kyrgyz way on a horse, with a horse track. Now the horses take a well-deserved break while we can enjoy a view to the Isik Cool Lake. What you see here is a true nomad camp. This is where people live, they have their horses here, they have goats and cows over there. This is the lifestyle the people used to have here in Kyrgyzstan. They were actually mountain nomads. As I said, 80% of the country are mountains. So they packed up their camp and set it up in the next valley whenever they wanted or they had to. Welcome to Karakol, a city which was founded by the Russians as a strategic location to explore everything which is southeast of Karakol. Today, it's a strategic location for all outdoor lovers because of its proximity to the highest mountains of the country. It's time to introduce you to the food of Kyrgyzstan and for this we're here in Karakol at the market. I'm here with Rachat and we're doing a little food tour here. Starting here at the market with... With Ashland food. With Ashland food. Okay, let's try it. So what we have here is a cold soup and it's basically the dish of the Dangan people, like the Chinese Muslim people who live here in Karakol. Mm. It also tastes a lot like garlic. This is a tartar dish called Asso which is basically <laughs> french fries, meat, pickles, cucumbers, onion, and again, garlic. <laughs> Next stop is the fat cat. And this is also how I feel like. We have our dessert here, chocolate cake, and some iced latte. I'm doing a one day trek here with Milan. It's called the Yogolot trek because of the village down there, it's named Yogolot. So it's a four hour trek, six kilometers. Pass. This is where we're going, the Karabeltek. So let's take on the last two kilometers. You know, the thing with hiking for me is that I always need a good view to make it worth it. And with the panorama here, I would say mission accomplished. And this is it from Kyrgyzstan. See you soon.